Hey guys, it's Jen. So Valentine's Day is coming up and some of you guys are wondering what I would possibly wear on Valentine's Day. So I made up five different outfits for five different scenarios. I hope you guys enjoy. For this particular outfit, I would probably wear it to a concert or a show. For my head accessory, I'm wearing my favorite and only beret that I thrifted from Aardvarks. And for jewelry, I'm wearing this lattice necklace from H&M. And this peach dot blouse is becoming one of my favorite tops because it, first of all, it has dots on it. And second, it has cutouts on the shoulder. And I basically tucked in the front so it has an asymmetrical hemline. For bottoms, I paired it with a pleather skirt that I purchased at H&M. And honestly, who said that you can't wear peep toes in the winter time? Just pair it with a pair of socks or in my case, opaque stockings. And voila, you have a winter heel. So for those who are living in a much warmer climate, um, this outfit is for you. For my hat, I wore this leopard sun hat which does a really great job getting the sun out of my face. And for jewelry, I paired it with this tiered necklace and I really like the fringe on the bottom. And for those who are really meh about wearing maxi dresses, this might be the perfect one for you because you still have an opportunity to show off your legs through the lace. I think it looks really cute. And I'm wearing my chevron bracelet that I got from John for my going away party back in August. For those who are getting wined and dined on Valentine's Day, this is probably what I would wear. Um, it's basically this green sleeve dress and I really like it because the back hides the bra strap perfectly. And the sleeves are really subtle and sexy and feminine and I thought I'd make it a little bit more interesting by adding these spiral tights from American Apparel. If you're spending Valentine's Day with the girls, I mean, I always say for girls' night out, just wear whatever you want. Just wear the most funkiest thing that you have because these girls are the ones that are going to understand the trends that you're wearing. So for my coat, I paired it with this faux fur leopard coat and it is insanely warm. You could just wear something little dainty and feminine underneath and just layer that over it. And for my top, I'm wearing a slouchy white button-up and has cutouts on the back and for my skirt I'm wearing this tulip pleated dusty rose skirt that kind of flares out the bottom and I'm wearing sheer tights that I got from a drugstore and the Jeffrey Campbellita. If you're not a skirt or a dress person, you should just go ahead and wear pants. There's really no rules in fashion or what you should wear, so this is my pant look. And for my top, I'm wearing a knit crop top that has a goldish sheen to it, and it's not really picking up on film, but it looks really pretty. And these are my favorite trousers. They're a great color, olive, which I consider a neutral, and I really like the way they drape on my legs. 